starting off, you're going to cover up your dark circles. Now this part is optional. If you're going to go for a more grungy rock look, then you can skip this part because you actually want to keep your dark circles. But I'm going for a more sophisticated look, so I'm going to cover mine up. And I'm also going to cover up any redness around my nose. And I'm going to cover up any other redness on my face and just blend that in. Now I'm taking my foundation and I'll be using my foundation brush and I'm going to apply that onto my face in crisscross motions so that way it's blended in nicely. And now I'm going to set my whole face with a loose powder. Now I'm actually going to do blush now. I'm going to suck in my cheekbones and just apply the blush on my cheekbones to sort of define them. Now I'm going to prime my eyes with the eyeshadow primer. This is going to help your eyeshadow last longer. The first color I'm going to be using is this really sheer neutral color. I'm going to apply that on the inner third of my eye and I'm going to blend that in and then I'm also going to use that as a highlight on my brow bone just to neutralize your eye. The next color is this purple color. I'm going to be applying that on the outer corner of my eye and blend it about halfway into the rest of your eyelid and just blend it up slightly. And my kitty came over to say hi because she loves you guys. Say hi, kitty. Well, I guess she did. But anyways, now I'm going to be taking the same purple color and I'm going to apply that underneath my eye area to blend it in into the purple above just to balance out my eyes. The next color is this darker purple here. I'm going to apply that into the outer corner of my eye with this little brush and then I'm going to be taking my blendy brush and I'm going to blend it in. Now I'll be lining my eyes with a roll-up eyeliner and just line closely to your lash line. Now I'm going to wing it out like this, just wing it up from where your eye would naturally extend out like that and then I'm going to fill it in and thicken it so that way it'll be a lot more thicker and have a larger wing. I'm just bringing it, it down slightly into the lower part of your eye and repeat the same process to the other eye. Make sure you check to see that they're even. Now I'll be setting the eyeliner with a black eyeshadow. I'll be using the blackest eyeshadow I have and just apply that over where I applied the eyeliner to set it. Now I'm lining my lower waterline with a white eyeliner to make your eyes look bigger. And now I'm going to be taking a very bright purple color and I'm going to apply that into my lower lash line just to add more color to the area. And now just define your brows as you normally would. Now I'm curling my lashes and apply a generous coat of mascara onto your top and bottom lashes. Now for the lips, I'm first going to be lining my lips with this maroon color here and fill them in with the same color. Now instead of using a lipstick, I decided to use a lip stain instead because I like the finish it gives and I know the applicator looks disgusting but it's just lip stain so don't freak out guys.
But anyway, so this is the finished look. It's very classy and it sort of has an elegance to it. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. Thank you for watching. Bye guys.